So here we have a very simple counter which will increment or decrement by the user input. It means whatever the user will write, the counter will increment by that number as well as decrement by that number. So here we have a simple code that is simply an input type that is of number with the event listener as simply on change. So this is used to grab whatever the user will write. So we will grab that with the help of event object. Then we simply have three buttons: one for incrementing the count, another for decrementing the count, and the last one for resetting the count. And then we have defined three functions. One will handle your decrement count, another will handle your increment count, and then this will simply handle your reset count. But here we have a small catch. If we directly take user input and then try to increment C, it is concatenating it. It means whatever type of input we have, whether it is type number, text, or any other type, it is simply treated as strings. And as you know, we cannot increment or decrement the strings. It will concatenate simply. So here we simply need to use. We need to convert this string into integer. So we will do this with the help of parseInt method. Now we can simply increment or decrementing by whatever the number the user will write. 